A very good afternoon to everyone. All the present time is the but to the time is the and no less the president. Speaking the blessings from Almighty, it's with tremendous pleasure. I am Jody S. T. from the Department of HP and CET. So I will be welcoming you all to this AIGP sponsored Adult FEP on Machine Learning Applications on Image Processing in 17 to 24 January 2022, organized by the Department of HP and ICOS. The aim of education is knowledge, not of the facts, but of the values. It's in programs like this, we get an opportunity to test our knowledge and understanding. We look forward to get an exposure about what the rest of the brain is saying about the very life of issues. I'm sure that the FDP will strengthen the grip and determination of the participants to reach their best destinies. I look forward to the renowned session. I would extend a cordial welcome to one and all present here. A famous proverb reads, learning is a treasure that will follow its owner everywhere. Let us all walk through life as we have something new to learn each and every day. Heading further, on behalf of MCT management, I'm honored to welcome the dignitaries on and off the air, distinguished keynote speakers, teaching and non-teaching faculty, and all the participants across the country to this inauguration of AICT sponsor at the FDP on machine learning applications of image processing. I would like to express my present a gracious welcome to you all. Let us begin today's auspicious event with the praise of the most merciful, the Almighty. I am very much delighted to call upon Mr. Ravikumar H.S., Assistant Professor Department of Chief for the for the soulful invitation. Ratnagar Bhaganapatim Tamashrayami Satatam Ratnavachana Giyamana Nijacharitra Vaibhavam Purnayesha Shekharam Pranavamaya Swarupinam Shiva Sutam me Bhavada Makila Purana Mangala Pratam Sharanu Sharanu Vegana Pane Sharanu Vena Kane Sharanu Padavita Nayane Kandane Sharanu Sharanu Vegana Pane Sharanu Vena Kane Sharanu Padavita Nayane
शरण शरण हे गणपन शरण भिनंतने शरण पार्वती तनयन निनय वंदने शरण शरण हे गणपन शरण भिनंतने शरण पार्वती तनयन निनय वंदने शरण शरण हे गणपन शरण भिनंतने Thank you, sir, for your display. I think you all have made the inception of the novel system course. I would now call upon Mr. Zaid, our Assistant Professor at Arthur PC, for the very few minutes. Okay, good afternoon to all who are present here. I, as a member, Assistant Professor at the Department of PC, NCT, extend my warm welcome to everyone present here. For the inaugural function of AICT as a sponsor development program on machine learning applications on image processing, which will be held in virtual mode from 17 January to 21 January 2022, organized by Department of PC and IQAC 7 NC. To welcome Mr. Show Honor, to welcome Mr. Established Group. On that note, I welcome all the honored dignitaries on and off the desk, keynote speakers faculty members, and my dear participants. First and foremost, I would like to welcome Chief Guest of the Day, Dr. S. G. Gopal Krishna, Director NGI, to this program. We are happy to have you here, sir. We are grateful for the motivation and support you have in the world. <laughs> May I request Dr. H. Venkatesh Kumar, Professor of EC Department, to lead the program. Thank you. I am honored and elated to welcome Dr. Jitendranath Mungana, Principal NCT, to this program. We are always grateful for your constant inspiration, support, and guidance. May I now request Dr. Baswara GM, Associate Professor of PC Department, to lead serve the program. I am profoundly delighted to welcome Dr. Nagesh Kane, Professor Hiroki of PC and convener of this program. We are always grateful for your motivation, support, and guidance. May I now request Dr. Ajay Kumar Devi, Associate Professor, Department of PC, to greet Sir with the whole day. Welcome, you, sir. I am profusely overjoyed to welcome the Athi FTP Program Coordinator, Dr. Rohit S, Associate Professor, Department of PC. May I now request Mr. Harish D, Assistant Professor, Department of PC, to please serve with the whole We welcome you, sir. I am elated to welcome Dr. Gopal Krishna, Dean RME, Mr. Ravi Shankar K, Dean Training and Placement. Mr. Ranjan Minish, Dean Icosel and Alumni Relations. I extend my sincere welcome to all the department attorneys, Dr. Mentesh Babu, Professor and HOD of Civil, Dr. Dinesha H.J., Professor and HOD of CSC, Dr. Yogesha H.C., COA, Professor and HOD of Mechanical, Dr. Anil Kanun, Professor and HOD of IAC, Dr. Gitanjali, Professor and HOD of MBA Department. I am delighted to welcome the Basic Science Department attorneys. Dr. Sarvesha MBCOA, Professor and HOD of Mathematics, Dr. Manjunata K, Professor and HOD of Chemistry, Professor Shanta T, HOD of Physics, and I am happy and very much delighted to welcome Mr. Shekhar K, Chief Librarian, Mr. Janardana Bhatsi K, Digital Education Director. We welcome you all for full family. I am elated to welcome the four coordinators of the IPLFTP, Mr. Harish P, Assistant Professor, Department of PC. Mr. Srinivas Lokhe, an assistant professor, department of PC, organizing committee, teaching and non-teaching fraternity. Last but not the least, I extend my sincere welcome to all the participants who have joined us for the program. Thank you. You look like a turn and treat. Everybody's name was that, and you did not leave out anybody. Good day. Thank you, ma'am, for your presentation. Thank you, ma'am. When darkness comes, let us not condemn the dark. 
would like the lamp to be lit to make the ceremony a blessed one. May I request and invite all the dignitaries to light the lamp and formally inaugurate the ceremony sponsored at the Deputy Chair. <laughs> No, I'm taking the support of both of you. Very refreshment of the Buddha. We are not online. We are not online. We are not online. We Anchor or coordinator, so at least she does not have to about the research topics, areas, that's what's going on in the world. This is a good opportunity to find out the type of the information through these FDP programs. It's not only from the conferences and the symposiums or on the workshops, that is also an area and also FDP programs also will help you to find out the the current burning areas, that is trust areas, you can find out from this. And another important point about the FDPs are, you will come to know, without your knowledge, you can update yourself. That is the beauty of the FDPs. Sitting five hours or four hours in the FDPs, other than what you know in the subjects,
are in the technologies, are in teaching scenarios. Okay, so easiest way of getting updated. That is my biggest advantage with the FDPs. So make use of the FDPs wherever, whenever that type of situations are occurring for you. Please attend to the FDPs. Whether it is normal or simple or technical, doesn't matter. But something you are going to add to your resume or to the knowledge side. You will have the right now some sort of the knowledge in some sort of the technologies. By attending to the FDP, you are sharpening your ideas and you are sharpening or updating your knowledge in the soft domain. That is an advantage. So don't ignore the FDPs at any time. It is always value added things to your life and to your future. That is how you have to make use of the FDP programs. Now coming to the this particular FDP program talks about the machine learning application through on image processing. Both are the different techniques. Image processing are the different technology and the machine learning is the different type of the approach. So you are using the image processing is the technology and you are going to use the machine learning concepts to that. So that is an advantage. See, doing 20 years back or 15 years back, image processing techniques are different. Now image processing techniques are different because AI and ML came into the picture now. With the help of the AI and ML concepts, we are aggressively going on in the image processing. The research has become very easy now because of the AI and ML concepts. Until unless you are very strong in AI and ML, you cannot do the good job in the IA, image processing or IP, whatever it is. Okay, so you have to take the collective way. The related technologies you must learn. You must be very strong in the algorithm side. But to develop the algorithms, to learn algorithms, you need to have some uh, some language. What is that language? At present is nothing but Python. So be strong in Python. That is very, very important. Learning Python is essential. It is not mandatory, it is an essential commodity now. And it is very easy to learn the Python on your own. That is another beauty of Python. Not necessary to go here and there and learn the Python. Not necessary. If you sit for two hours per day, within 30 days of time, you will become a master in Python. Once you know the Python, learning the machine learning is, the, is not at all a problem at all. Once you are put in the machine learning areas, Implementation of the machine learning algorithms in the image processing will become easy. That will become very, very easy now. So it is a linking services. So you are starting somewhere here and your implementation is going to be somewhere in the technology side. To do here, you have to and you must be associated with all these areas. That is very important. Just reading and studying and understanding is not rich enough. You must get the expertise. The expertise will get only when you will attend some sort of the conferences, some sort of the FDPs and TMDs, that is technology faculty development programs. And there are webinars. Through all these facilities, you can learn a lot and you can do a better and you can reach to your expectations. So my final request and sincere session for you all guys, you have to attend. Don't miss any, any time of the FDPs, webinars, seminars, conferences, and we are here to help you. And we, have, we are here to support you. If it is an even outside, we are ready to send you. If it is outside of the state, we are ready to give the support financially, I am ready for that. So making, you have to make use of the facilities in the campus. So hoping that you are going to have the pleasant time, whether it is online or offline participants, please enjoy the sessions and you are definitely you are going to get very good knowledge transfer from this FDP 
I wish you all the best and take something to the home after five days. You need to check your account. I have sent, I have spent a lot of valuable time of five days. During these five days, how much that I acquired the knowledge? That needs to be questioned by yourselves. You have to check in that way. You have to add some quantity of the knowledge to your end. That should be the question for you. So, take the accountability from the FDPs and add it to your, as an extra dimension to your resume and enjoy the sessions. All the best and God bless you. Thank you, sir, for the engaging about the foundation of the energy and for briefing about the importance of the technical upgrading. And now, very much delighted and pleased to call upon Dr. Mangesh Chain, Professor in the Department of DC, and the Controller of the Secretary, to for the brief insight into the energy. A very good afternoon to all of you. Respected Director, Dr. S. D. Gopal Krishna, Principal, Dr. Jitendra Mugara, FDB Coordinator, Dr. Rohit, HODs of various departments, faculty members, and my dear participants. I am pleased to welcome you all to the AICT Atal sponsored five days faculty development program on machine learning application on image processing from 17th to 21st January 2022 by the Department of ECE, Nagarjuna College of Engineering and Technology. Faculty Development Program is a skill development program specially designed for academic educators. In recent trends, machine learning approach for image processing application are more attracted by the researchers. Introduction of machine learning concepts making the work to happen very quicker in intelligent manner. I am happy to inform Department of ECE, Dr. Rohit S. Associate Professor received approval from AACT in the month of December 2021 to conduct AACT Atal sponsored FDP in online mode with the fund of 93,000. <laughs> Department of ECE really amazed to see the impressive registration. We had 200 registrations from all the corners of the country in short span of time. We have eminent and distinguished keynote speakers from IITs, reputed organizations and industries. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you, sir, for speech and span inside the presentation and reading about the problems and the questions you follow. It says that if your actions inspire others to read more, learn more, do more, and become more, you are a leader. I am honored and gratified to call upon one of the eminent efficient leaders, Dr. S.D. Gopal Krishna, Director Engineering and request him to address the other. Good afternoon to all. Who is ahead waiting for you? So maybe people are hungry. That's why they will be sleeping. We are Dr. Jitendra, Dr. Nagesh, and uh, Dr. Rohit, other heads of the departments and uh, faculty members and the coordinators of the FDP from the EC department, faculty of other departments, and participants from across the country through online. Corona has taught us all these things. And it is because of that uh, the online uh, 
conducting other workshops, conferences, seminars, so all that has become very easy. Congratulations to Dr. Nagesh and Dr. Rohe for the excellent effort that they have made in organizing this uh, FTP. As uh, Dr. Jitendra was mentioning, the FTP is a continuous process which uh, you should utilize. Whenever the opportunity comes, you should utilize. When we say faculty development, okay, and he said uh, you have to sharpen your skills. Yes, Python you mentioned. Sharpening the skill, that uh, famous uh, story is there, no? One woodcutter cutting the logs. Initially he cuts 10 logs per day. Then finally slowly it drops down to 5 logs or 4 logs like that. The production, the productivity, what we call, comes down. And another uh, new person who has joined, he cuts uh, again 10 logs only. So this fellow asks that person, how are you are able to cut 10 logs? He says, your axe is not sharp. You have to sharpen your axe. So sharpen your skill sets. Unless you sharpen your skill sets, you cannot do well. FTP is given opportunity for you to sharpen all your skill sets. Now, uh, coming to this uh, FTP, yesterday I was just going through one uh, article uh, from uh, ISRO. Very interestingly, there are a lot of phases in the launch of the satellite vehicles. A satellite when it is launched, its main function will be taking the images, sending those images. So image processing should happen in the ground station. Processing will not be done in the satellite. It just captures the image, number one. The second one is a lot of sensors are there all electronic sensors which can sense the different other criteria of that particular planet. It may be the uh, environment there, it may be the gaseous uh, substances which are there, it could be even the solid substances which are there. So there are a lot of such things. See, always if you want to launch a flight, for example, a passenger flight, you have an opportunity to test that. Initially you run it on the ground, then slowly you lift it up and then again land it perfectly, lift it higher, lift it higher. That way you have uh, opportunity for testing. But whereas in a satellite it is very difficult. You cannot have this kind of a test, but all simulations are done. And these simulated tests are done when you want to launch a satellite. India is a leader in the satellite launching now. One very interesting statement by the new ISRO chairman is that he says you can send a human being to the space, but it is very difficult to get it back alive. Very, very interesting uh, problem that is faced. See, unless you are sure that human being will come back in his original style and shape, it's very difficult to send people. First of all, you cannot convince them. And uh, secondly, you cannot send. There are various stages uh, which uh, I was uh, very curiously seeing. One is, supposing uh, if the satellite is having some problem, the artificial intelligence is applied there, it foresees the problem, it analyzes the situation, it foresees the problem and sends a signal to the ground station saying that this satellite should be aborted. The addition to be made 
very very crucial. So whether to abort a segment or not is again main. Very nice, very nice application. And uh, if there is a heavy traffic, automatically you take a deviation. Okay, all these are okay. Yesterday I have seen one very interesting uh, application where a person will not wear the mask just like me now. He is not wearing the mask, he will say, Take me to the mark. Mark will say, I will take you to the nearest crematorium. Again, he says, probably Google did not understand. So, again, he will repeat. Take me to the nearest mall. I am saying to this place. He again explains where the mall is. He says, I will take you to the Hindu crematorium. What is this? He is saying like this. He gets fed up. And then finally, he wears the mask. When he wears the mask, automatically it will say, I will take you to the mall you suggested. What an application. You see, the artificial intelligence is applied there also. Like this, there are so many examples where you have a lot of applications which are making our life I am very happy that uh, this kind of uh, FTP has been harmonized in our college. Very great to know that within a short time you are able to reach 200 uh, registrations. That's a fantastic number. Are you going to bring out some kind of uh, proceedings in the end? Yes, sir. Of all the presentations that have been done, yes. you will bring out the proceedings. Very nice. Okay. Yeah, very good, very good. Yeah, bring out that uh, proceedings so that if any reference is to be made for that, the participants will have that as a reference of the material. Congratulations again uh, to uh, Rohit and his entire team under the able leadership of uh, Nagesh. The FDP has been organized. Very nice. I wish this uh, FDP to be a 
successful, fruitful, useful one to the participants. I wish good luck to all. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir, for making us understand the importance of meat processing and where time goes towards spend time with most of you. A thankful heart is not only of the greatest virtues, but of failing for all other virtues. With this cheerful quote, I would now like to call upon Mr. J.P. Prakash, Assistant Professor and Partner for PhD, to propose the word of God. A very good afternoon to all of us present here. Myself, D.P. Prakash, Assistant Professor, Department of Economics and Communication, and C.P., take this honor and privilege to propose the vote of thanks on this occasion of Faculty Development Program sponsored by AICT Training and Learning Academy on machine learning applications on image processing. It's often said gratitude is not only the greatest of virtues, but the parent of all of us. On that note, first and foremost, I express my sincere gratitude towards NCT management for their constant support, guidance, and encouragement in every aspect. Thank you. I express sincere thanks towards AICT for sponsoring Atal FTP. I extend my deep sense of appreciation and heartfelt gratitude to Dr. S.G. Gopal Krishna, Director NGI. We are grateful for your time and for raising this occasion with your presence. Thank you, sir. I extend my sincere thanks and heartfelt gratitude to Dr. Jitendra Kungara, Principal and CET. We are grateful for your time and sharing with us your findings and opinions today. Thank you, sir. I'm also delighted to express a sincere thanks to Dr. Nagesh Kayan, Professor and Head of the Department of Electronics and Communication and Convener of the FTP for constant support and guidance. Thank you, sir. I am elated to express my sincere thanks to AICT Adult Sponsor Program Coordinator of this FTP, Dr. Rohit S., Associate Professor in the Department. I extend my sincere and warmest thanks to Dr. H.C. Yogesha, COE, Professor and Head of Mechanical Department, Dr. Venkatesh Babu, Professor and Head of Civil Department. Dr. Dinesha Hachi, Professor and Head of CS Department. Dr. Anil Kanu, Professor and Head of IS Department. Dr. Manjunata K, Professor and Head of of Chemistry. Mr. Shekhar K, Chief Librarian. Thank you all. I express my sincere thanks to co coordinators, Mr. Harish B, Assistant Professor, IS Department. Mr. Srinivas Rukhayan, Associate Assistant Professor ENC, and all the team members for their efforts and dedication in making this program a resounding success. Finally, I would like to take this opportunity to place on record a hearty thanks to organizing committee, teaching, and non-teaching fraternity. Last but not the least, I am delighted to express my sincere thanks to all the participants who have joined virtually for this FTP. A big heart and thanks to one and all. Thank you. Over. Oh, well. Thank uh, the FTP. <laughs> yes, thank everybody. Yeah. <laughs> 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 